Well, guess where we're at? We're at Triple Tree this week. It's just one of our favorite fly-ins. It's extremely low key. Might be two or three vendors here. We got a wonderful campsite. We've been here since yesterday morning and it's kind of light so far when Thursday and Friday are the big days. Tonight's the seafood dinner. Tomorrow night's cook your own steak. We've got a really nice campsite here in the shade. Works out well. We got shade in the morning and shade in the evening. And we've been watching airplanes land this morning. I don't know if you can catch one out there. It might be a Mustang just landed. And uh, just a really neat place. And we'll show you some video out there in a little bit. The camping here at Triple Tree is really pretty. So we've got some really nice campsites in the woods, as you noticed before. Campsites here with your airplane all along this beautiful lake. And then across the way, here's the main runway. We're landing, been landing runway three all week. There's somebody coming in. This is the most beautiful runway I've ever landed on. I don't think there's a putting green in the world that could compete with it. It's like landing on a foam pillow. <laughs> it's really, really nice. Here's the other side of that beautiful lake. Clearly, helicopters are underrepresented. And everybody keeps asking about the hummingbird, so we've got some conniving to do to see if we can't get it up here. Here's the flight line with all the transient stuff. And Pat Harness is beautiful, Spartan. I think there's only 12 flying in the whole world. And this one's just drop dead gorgeous. We've seen it fly a couple times already. So here's a little close up of this just drop dead gorgeous Spartan. Again, only one of, I think, 12 flying in the whole country. Perhaps the world. There were, I think, only 30 or something built. And uh, I think maybe 20 remain or something. But it is just gorgeous. Pat just does everything first class here. Runway, the parking. Here you can see the flight line. This is all the day parking. So we've got everything from drop dead gorgeous beavers, palatuses, swifts, bonanzas, a whole row of RVs. All I got to tell all you RVs, you're, you're clearly underrepresented here. Come on, let's get in the airplanes and get to Triple Tree. It's uh, just gorgeous weather this week. So we look forward to seeing some more of you here between Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. There are all kinds of neat airplanes to see here at Triple Tree. Here's a little toot. I think this one might have been highlighted in uh, Sport Aviation earlier, but it sure is pretty. So you can see all the day trippers here. And a really drop dead gorgeous beaver over there with a modernized paint scheme. Really pretty. And here's a wonderful control tower at Triple Tree. Pay attention, there is a, I guess you'd call it a notum, but there are procedures flying into here. There's two waypoints to the southeast that you go to, Wally World and Ennery, and then fly over the top and they'll tell you which runway to land on and they're doing a bang up job. How's this for timing? There's the Spartan, isn't that beautiful?